Welcome back to my small tasting of champagne here, or not that small actually. I'm going through quite a few uh, wonderful wines here. Next one up is the Cuvée Louis from um, the family producer of Tarlan. And uh, this is a very interesting one. This is not really indicated on the label. Uh, very often when you talk about vintages and maturity, it's not that easy to see. But this is actually clearly communicated on the back label. This is a mix of um, 98, 97, 96 vintages. 50% Pinot Noir, 50% Chardonnay and uh, aged on the lease until it was disgorged in 2008. And I find some of these um, vintage cuvées with high maturity being very interesting if you compare with the Cru Grand Cuvée and um, Laurent Paré Grand Siècle. So it's in the, in the same, made in the same style with the same spirit. Uh, still, I would say on the nose, it's not very, very developed. There's a good depth, there's a good level of complexity. But still, it's very pure and very clean in terms of fruitiness. Uh, of course, we do have notes, uh, more notes coming from the aging uh, than you know primary fruit aromas. There's plenty of fresh butter and uh, hints of brioche in there. And in terms of fruit character, it's more, uh, it, it's quite yellow fruity character, like peach and apricot, something in that direction. It's a nice attack on the palate, really bone dry with a razor sharp precision. But I don't think this is a whole of acidity, it's really ripe acidity, which is just, you know, nice and mouth watering, very cleansing on the palate with a big structure, really nice and pure fruit, and a long clean finish. Um, I'm not sure personally on a, on, a, on a personal level how well extra brut ages uh, actually, and I think this has already gotten a fair deal of, um, of aging already. Uh, in my mind this would be best drunk now, but as I said, I'm not sure, I don't have the experience of very, very old extra brut. But uh, definitely this is champagne I'd love to serve with um, food and uh, something um, um, very delicate in terms of texture. I would go for sweetbreads of veal with uh, with sep mushrooms or uh, um, pan-fried scallops with uh, or um, king crab or anything. I mean very elegant in terms of texture that needs something with its purity and minerality to cope with it.